Make sure to subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. The way she blind, not the way she make her body. Not the way she blind, not the way she make her body. Not the way she blind, not the way she make her body. Not the way she blind, not the way she make her body. Not the way she blind, not the way she make her body. Her. Yeah, up until week 11 of last season, Joe Burrow was well on his way to staking claim as the best rookie QB of 2020. He was living up to the dreams of the tortured Bengals faithful. But then a nightmare as the first round pick was carted off the field with a brutal knee injury. Now, just nine months since reconstructive surgery, Joe Cool is back under center and bringing hope to Cincinnati. Joe, who's your karaoke song? I don't think I've ever done karaoke before. This guy. What? Yeah. Do you like interviews? Not really. No. Not my favorite. What don't you like about them? I'm just not a camera guy. Got to make sure the hair is right. Got to do all that stuff. <laughs> There's not a hair out of place. It <laughs> looks great. I'm telling you. Biggest nightmare for Bengals fans was an injury to rookie quarterback Joe Burrow. And he was Let's go back, if we can, um, to that moment on the field when you got hurt. Take me through that. My knee hurt. That's all, really all I could think about at the time, you know, on the field. I mean, there was quite a bit of damage. It kind of hit me when I got to the x-ray room that my season was going to be done. And so I got a little emotional. But then, you know, after the game, I tried to focus on the plays that I did play and where I could get better in that area. You were um, thinking about that. In the moment that you recognized your rookie season in the NFL is over, you're already thinking about the plays that you could have done better? Yeah, I mean... It's, you don't want to sit and dwell on all the games you're going to miss. So you just try to focus on, on the reps that you had, try to get better You're a much somehow. better person than I am, man. <laughs> I step my toe when I think about that for the rest of the day, let alone what I did well during the day. So the Bengals lost you, but you lost football. How good does it feel to have it back? It feels great. You know, a lot of work went into this. That was my first major injury of my entire sporting career. Yeah. It's just a matter of how you respond to it. And here comes Joe Burrow. Done. Burrow drops straight back to throw again. He's going to fire it long for Joe Burrow. Yeah. Over the shoulder catch yeah. at the 15. How much fun is this game for you? It's a lot of fun, especially when we play the way we did on Sunday. Yeah. Losing isn't very fun. Losing isn't something that you're used to. When they brought you in, you're going to be the savior of this. You're going to save this organization. Is that pressure that you like? And I think pressure is more of an, an outside word that people use. If you don't let the environment and if you don't let the situation get to you, there's, there's no pressure. It's just a matter of how you prepare and how you perform. I love it. Have you watched, you've seen Top Gun. I don't think I have seen Go, Top Gun. You, Joe, you stop it right now. You've <laughs> never seen Top Gun? No. Tom Cruise, Maverick? No. Val Kilmer, I was going to say you're Iceman. Nothing affects you. There's ice in your veins. Never seen Okay, it. you have homework. You need to come up with a karaoke song, and you have to watch Top Gun. You got a deal. That's when you know you're old, when your interview subject has never seen Top Gun. But guess what? He hasn't lost that love and feeling in Cincinnati, Michael. Oh, I had oh, to. Good.